about four or five days ago, maybe a week or so ago, she had one of those come to Jesus moments. How many of you ever had one of them? Where it's just not a regular prayer. You actually start praying and the Holy Spirit comes down and ministers to you. And she did. And she got down and prayed. And the Lord said, that's enough. When I gave her what I felt about her, when I talked to her and I said, your problem is for 51 years you've been on a merry-go-round. And if you'll get off that merry-go-round, some of you here, some of you might still be on the merry-go-round. Keep going round and round. And you keep, you, you keep making the same mistakes. And it won't happen again and then you do it again. Because you see, we don't line up with that book. Yeah, but he was cute. Or yeah, but I think he loved me. Or yeah, he said all the right words. She said all the right words. Come on. Relationships. That we don't listen to the word of God. We don't, you know, I, I get hundreds and hundreds of communications about broken marriages. And I hear all the stuff about these men. I hear all the stuff about these women. And I said to them, how many days did you pray before you got married? How, how many days did you fast before you decided to choose him? We're talking about brokenness tonight. It lines up with life. It lines up with everything in life. This young lady had a come to Jesus moment. It touched my heart. And she's telling me about it. I'm on the other end. Now, I'm alpha male. I didn't want her to see me cry. I'm over here crying, man, listening to this story. And she said she got up. Guess what she did the next morning? She made some people leave. She got rid of some things. Come on. That's what happens when you really meet Christ. There is a change in your life. I can tell you right now, you can go to 425 Dials Branch Ranch in Kentucky. You can go up on the hill behind my house and there's a case of beer up on the hill. I got saved that morning, drunk, threw every bit of it up on the mountain. There was a change in my life. There was a change that took place in this young lady's life. 